In this video, we'll look at whether strontium chloride, that's SrCl2, is acetic, basic, or neutral when it's dissolved in water. To do that, we need to look at the neutralization reaction that produced the strontium chloride. So we have hydrochloric acid plus strontium hydroxide. That gives us a salt, the strontium chloride, and water. It's a neutralization reaction. Once we have the equation, we need to look at the strength of the acid and the base. This is a really good chart to memorize of some common strong acids and bases. We go down and there's hydrochloric acid, strong acid, little SA up there. Strontium hydroxide is right here. It's considered a strong base, so we'll put an SB there. So now that we have the strength of the acid and the base, we can use the rules to determine whether SRCl2 is acetic, basic, or neutral in water. So we're looking for a strong acid and a strong base in our rules. Here's a strong acid and a strong base. According to the rules, the pH will remain neutral at 7. So according to our rules, when we put strontium chloride in water, the resulting solution should be neutral and have a pH of 7. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.